Cookery 9, Quarter to Week 5. Types of Bread. Let's recall. Let's put your knowledge to the test. Directions. 1. Write down your answers on a notepad. 2. Questions will be flashed for 10 seconds. 3. Strictly no opening of notes. Classify each sandwich whether it's hot or cold. 1. Hamburgers. 2. Hot. Two Mexican burrito. Answer Hot. Three Clubhouse sandwiches. Answer cold. Four tuna fried sandwich. Answer hot. Five pinwheel sandwiches. Answer cold. Who got a perfect score? Good job! Now let us proceed to our proper lesson in Cookery 9. Objectives in this lesson You should be able to identify bread suited for sandwich making. Let's understand types of bread. A. Yeast bread. Loaf bread is the most widely used sandwich bread. One, white bread. These are long rectangular loaves with square slices. It's one of the most versatile Ellie sandwich breads. It comes in a variety of flavors and goes well with everything and toasts nicely. Two, whole wheat bread. It is a classic sandwich bread. Nutritionally superior to white bread, tastes better, and has more interesting textures. It is slightly more compact and brownish in color.
3. Rye bread. A stronger taste of bread than white and whole wheat. A heavy and hearty flavor of bread that goes with so many types of meat and condiments. B. Buns and Rolls 1. Sandwich Rolls A soft type of bread which comes in all sizes, shapes and textures. 2. The softest are hamburger buns and hot dog rolls. 2. French Italian bread. The rolls, including sourdough and ciabatta, are divided horizontally. It works fine for grilled sandwiches. 3. Flat breads are basically unleavened bread made without yeast. Flour, water, and salt are the main ingredients. 1. Pita. It comes in white and whole wheat. When the flat bread is baked, it puffs up, forming a pocket that's perfect for stuffing. 2. Focaccia, a flat oven baked Italian bread, similar in style and texture to pizza dough. It is made with yeast and olive oil and is flavored with herbs. 3. Lovash, small and rectangular, when softened in water, it can be rolled around a stuffing to make a pinwheel-shaped sandwich. 4. Tortillas unleavened round corn meal breads baked on hot stone, ranging in size from 6 inch to 14 inch or larger, preferably used for quesadillas and burritos. D. Wraps are very thin flat breads used for sandwich wraps, burritos and tacos. 1. Sandwich wraps, either whole wood or spinach flavor. 2. Tortillas E. Quick brands are raised by the chemical action of baking powder or baking soda such as biscuits, banana bread, carrot bread and generally more tender and crumbly than yeast bread. 3. It is used for sweeter tasting sandwiches and is best used for tea sandwiches. That's it. That is the types of bread. Let's try this. Name what bread is being described. 1. The softest are hamburgers, buns and hot dog rolls. Buns and rolls, or wraps. 
Answer, buns and rolls. Two, this is very flat breads used for sandwich wraps, burritos and tacos. Buns and rolls, or wraps. Answer, wraps. Three, loaf bread is the most widely used sandwich bread. Flat breads, or yeast bread. Answer, yeast bread. Four, basically unleavened bread made without yeast. Flour, water, and salt are main ingredients. Flat breads or yeast bread. Answer, flat breads. Five, raised by the chemical action of baking powder or baking soda such as biscuits, quick breads or yeast bread. Answer, quick breads. Who got a perfect score? Good job. I hope that you learned a lot in our lesson for today. Thank you for joining today's class. See you next meeting. Bye.